My name is Bob Lanning. I'm here to tell you about making a train diorama in HO scale. Now this diorama is very historic because we uh, show the original railroad, which we, you, you can see the overlapping there as we have here. We have the narrow gauge and then the later standard gauge railroads that were built about 1915 to haul the ore down after the uh, narrow gauge had closed down. The narrow gauge actually ran again during the First World War because of copper shortages, but about 1920 that wasn't needed anymore and they just relied on all the standard gauge railroads that ran out of Clarkdale out to the, out to the big world with the, the processed ore. Now behind me you see the little town of Drum Junction which, uh, which is now Chino Valley, Arizona. There was a hotel there and a depot and that's where the uh, the Prescott, Santa Fe, and Phoenix Railroad, which was the original standard gauge railroad at Ashford, came in and the, the ore was transferred uh, from the narrow gauge to the standard gauge, as you can see that little uh, trestle structure here. So that was actually some dual gauge track, which able to run a standard gauge and narrow gauge. Standard gauge is four foot eight and a half. Narrow gauge was, uh, there's various narrow gauges, but the narrow gauge here was a three foot narrow gauge. 